When was your first recollection that your family, your mother, this dynamic was different than the other kids in school? Probably when I was in fifth grade and she showed up drunk to school and on my birthday and she was like dancing and singing in the cafeteria. I didn't want to be known as the girl with the drunk mom and it was really embarrassing to me. I feel like I don't have a mom anymore. I just feel like she's some lady that lives at the house and eats the food and watches our TV. And when celebrations would come up, birthdays, Christmas, any kind of celebration where most kids were like wide-eyed and excited, you looked at those with dread because you knew this is just a train wreck coming. Yes, sir. I knew she was going to be drunk. And if she did anything sneaky, I would go tell my dad and be like, can you go check her purse? I think that she snuck wine in. And my dad would check it and sure enough, there'd be wine. It broke my heart to read your letter to me because I realized that you wrote it on Christmas night. Yes, sir. Go ahead and read this for us. Dr. Phil, my name is Rachel. I'm 19 years old. I would never have thought I would be writing to you, but at this point, you are my family's only hope. My mother is an alcoholic and a pill addict. We don't think she will stop. She's been arrested three times for DUI, shoplifting, probation violation. She picked me and my friends up from school while she was drunk. I had to pull her out of the bathtub because she was so messed up that she slipped under the water and was about to die. She threatened my brother with a knife when he tried to prevent her from driving drunk. She was drunk every birthday, holiday, celebration. She was drunk for all school events, including high school graduations and college graduations. She was drunk on my brother's wedding day, and she's just out of control. She lies at AA meetings and will grab a chip and say she's been sober for a month, but in reality, she drank that morning. I'm scared for my mom. I'm scared she's gonna end up dead or in prison. Please help my mom and our family.